Hello, Winabbers. My name is Jesse Meekham from Winab. It stands for You Need a Budget. Yes, you do. This is another Whiteboard Wednesday. I want to bring us back to the basics. Mainly, I'm concerned about those people that had their budgets fail because of the eclipse. Your budget failed. You fell off the wagon. That's why I drew a wagon here. And uh, whether it was really the eclipse or maybe uh, your transition to a new job, uh, you just moved, you had some big emergency, you just came back from a three month long vacation and for some reason the budget just wasn't happening. So you have this long break where you didn't really budget and you feel guilty about it and I'm here to tell you, just feel a little guilty and then let's get back on the wagon. There are three different ways you can do it. One, you can do what we just call the reconciliation and that involves what we call the shrug difference. It means at one point in your budget you had recorded what you actually had and it was current and now it's no longer current and there's a difference between what you had in the budget and what you now have and you just need to reconcile those two. And that difference, that's the shrug difference. It means, well, there's a difference. What are you going to do with it? Nothing, really. You're just going to make the adjustment and then from this day forward say, okay, with the money on, I have on hand right now, what will I do? It's just like when you started with YNAB. With the money you had on, had on hand then, you just said, what do I do? Well, now you're doing the same thing. You're starting with YNAB. With the money you have on hand right now, what do you do? So you just make a big adjustment to all the accounts, bring them up current. Do not try and categorize months and months of transactions. It's tedious and boring and uh, you just want to claw your eyes out. So don't do that. Just start now. Make one big fat adjustment. Make a category for it called fat adjustment and move forward. Then give every dollar a job. Make sure your budget has all of your current money allocated and just move forward. Done. Second option, you can do the fresh start. That's why I have these little flowers here planted. Fresh start is where you say, okay, I don't care about any of the history of my budget, but I do want to keep my categories and my accounts intact. This feature is so popular. If you click up on the name of your budget, top right, you can see it says make a fresh start, where we do all of this for you. We know people want to restart their budget. For better or worse, they just want to get going again. One of our great teachers, Dave, I think he does a fresh start every year, and he says it's very... Uh, therapeutic, very instructive to just look at that big pile of money that he has and then say, what should this money do before I'm paid again? It really helps kind of clarify his priorities. There's a blog post about it. I should link to it. So a fresh start is another option. Finally, you can go with the nuclear option. And the nuclear option just means you don't worry about fresh start keeping the categories and accounts. You don't worry about keeping all of your history and transactions and just doing a big reconciliation difference. All you worry about is you want to have a clean slate. So you just go up to your budget name and you say, start a new budget. Then you got to set up all your new categories. You got to uh, add all your accounts. Uh, maybe there's a situation there where you could simplify and consolidate some of your accounts. Anyway, uh, you get all that and you're brand new. It's like you never started YNAB before. And actually, this is a really fun spot to be in because you know a ton of stuff about YNAB, you know how it works, you know how you would have set things up if you were setting things up again, and now you are setting things up again, and you can set it up just the way you like it. I think even on the YNAB subreddit, there's a thing about how are your categories structured and stuff like that. And I know we've given workshops about the ideal, not ideal category structure, but category structures to make you go, hmm, and I think you could look at those and just say, oh, I like how that's set up, maybe I'll try that. The world is your oyster. Really, all you need to do is just start again. Here, you're starting again. Here, you're starting again. Here, you're starting again. And that is the common thread. You stopped, now you're starting again. Welcome back, we're very happy to have you. I will see you next week.